what's going on vlog i hope you guys are having an awesome monday that's what today is this weekend was crazy we saw a car accident flashback to that Then we had a crazy rain flash ice storm that took out Jenna's massage opportunity. And now we're here today, Monday the 16th. Yep, Monday, April 16th. We found a few nice places in St. Catharines. I'm gonna be most likely moving to St. Catharines. Uh, I'm gonna be working out of Welland and St. Catharines, training clients out of both cities. But with that being said, we found some really cool places with nice big backyards for the boys. Um, we're not gonna be looking to get an apartment this time. We're looking to uh, get a house because we're at a point now where our boys deserve to have that freedom of, it's just so much better being in an environment where you have a house, you could control what happens, and a backyard with two boys with a garage. So I'll, be, I'll probably end up training clients out of there as opposed to out of here. Um, but that's all dependent on the place that we get. Stay tuned for that growth. But right now I'm about to do some arms. I'm waiting for a client to get here for 11 o'clock. Showed up a little bit early so I could get my own training session. So here we go. So if you're new to working out, one thing you probably didn't know is that grabbing the bar here and doing your tricep extensions, so grabbing it here versus grabbing it like this versus grabbing it like this. So grabbing it here, grabbing it here with your thumbs and grabbing it here will all make differences in what part of the tricep is being targeted. Also grabbing in here, getting a longer bar, grabbing wide, will all play different factors into what part of the tricep you're targeting. As you know, the tricep consists of three muscles, bicep, two muscles, bi, tri, tripod, three legs. You know what it's about. to go back and forth from biceps to triceps. It's a way of holding me accountable to making sure I get every set in. This next movement, last movement I'm about to show you is called Scrush, Scrush, no. It's called Skull Crushers. Give it a shot if you haven't tried it. A lot of people know about this movement, but if you haven't heard of it, check it out. If you're doing triceps and you want a good burn, Skull Crushers. Some people like to grab really close on their Skull Crushers, come down, up, 
Spill it up, which is nice. It does push the contraction to the tricep. Some other people will grab about here, so about shoulder width. I am one of those people that like to grab nice and close. I feel like it forces the tricep to contract the entire time. We're just allowing the shoulders to come up. This is what it looks like. Make them nervous when you're standing close, but still he ain't done with you. It don't even matter what you been doing. Still he ain't done with you yet. Yeah. Now if you notice, I don't come all the way up to here and hold and then back down and rest here and then hold. It's about going up, squeeze, right back into the movement. Above. Are you working up? Yep, five minutes early. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> so you're gonna have to wait. That's fine. 20 seconds. And then we're done. So if you guys want to give those a try, go ahead, let us know if you like them. By those I'm talking about the skull crushers, but I just finished up with a client and now because you guys do follow me on Facebook and I know it, I'm going to be completing that challenge that I talked to you guys about, which is spelling your name out. And I'm not going to spell my name out, I'm going to make it a little more interesting. So I'm going to spell out A, G, fitness. So here it is. All right, so here's what we have ahead of us. So we have 50 jumping jacks, 20 arm circles, 10 burpees, 30 jumping jacks, 15 squats, 20 burpees, one minute of wall sit, 30 burpees, and 30 burpees. So we have a total of 70 burpees to do. Let's go do it. Here's a time lapse. I'm gonna do them in order. So we're starting with 50 jumping jacks. Twenty arm circles. Is this what this is? I thought this was a stretch, not a workout. Ten burpees. Thirty jumping jacks. So we just finished the I in fitness. We're now on to T, 15 squats. <sighs> 25 burpees. Woo! Here we go. I'm doing my burpees on my knuckles so my watch doesn't hurt my wrist. 25 burpees. <laughs> Ooh, it's getting a little hot. Twenty-five burpees. Feels great. Now we're on to E in fitness, which is one minute wall sit. So we're gonna get the time going. So you wanna be on a 90 and go. We are on to the final movements. Then asked me if I wanted to get beer and help clean tonight once I'm done vlogging. I think there's only one answer to that. So here we go. Now we have 60 burpees. You guys count them with us. If I make it to the end without dying, because you guys all know how difficult it is, if I make it to the end, you need to hop down at the bottom, click that like button, hit the thumbs up, share it if you can, subscribe to the YouTube channel. If I'm doing this, you gotta do something. 
Shake on it. That's how you shake, there it is. So here we go, 60 burpees. Sometimes when you have a big number ahead of you, it's best to break it down. So if we're doing 60, I'm gonna do 10 in my head. Reset, count to 10, reset, count to 10. It's a psychological game in a way at, at the end of the day. So here we go. We do this. We get it. We we get a bit. Of, we better get minimum of 60 likes. Here we go. Last 30 reps. Last 20 reps. Five more. Five more. 